Jinping will continue his improved recent form with a great win in the York Half Marathon on Sunday. His winning time of 63 minutes 49 seconds was easily a club and county record. Also in the picture is Angie Page from Leeds University who won the ladies race. There is no truth whatever in the rumour that Jim and Angie are getting together for training or any other activities. And now, let us have a word with the great man himself. Right, Jim. Uh, fantastic win at uh, York. You must have been very, very pleased with that. Um, I believe you didn't have much, too much difficulty. How did it go for That's you? That's a lot, really. You're saying fantastic win, but you were talking to me in the pub three or four days beforehand as if it was absolutely a formality. So the truth is probably somewhere between the two. Um, looking at the field before the, the start, I thought I really should win this, but it wasn't going to be that easy, and, and that's just about how it worked out. Yeah, well, I think uh, we were thinking at the time, three or four days, that 65 minutes might do it. Well, obviously, 63.49. Uh, has proved that uh, it wasn't perhaps so easy as I may led you to believe. No, I, I was quite impressed with uh, Callum Bark, who uh, ran fairly strongly the whole way. And I think his personal best marathon is only about 2.18. Yeah. So either the course is short or he ran pretty well. Or maybe he's got a bit to come. <laughs> Could be, yes. Yeah. So maybe he's a better half marathon runner than marathon runner. I don't know the guy really. But, yeah. uh, he yeah. seemed to run quite well. So this is, uh, this is the week of the 12 stage now. Uh, we've now got six legs of six miles and six of three. Lovely. <laughs> so, um, obviously it changes one or two. A couple of people will be happy. <laughs> yeah. um, and uh, it's looking quite good. Have you any feelings about the 12th stage on, on Saturday? Well, I've been doing my homework over the last couple of years' results. And, and we've got our work cut out to finish in, in the first ten, I believe it is, to qualify yeah, for the national. Right. Um, we'll have run very well if we can get in that ten. And if I was asked to guess, I would say probably about 12th or 13th is more realistic. I think we're going to have to be right on top of our forum. Yeah. Having said that, um, some people are running reasonably well. I'm, I'm certainly happy with my own forum. Yes. And uh, Malcolm Prince seems to be getting running well again. That's right. And we can bat right down the number 12. We're not putting in any joggers. So. Uh, that's true. I, I think if we do make it, it's going to be with seconds to spare, though. Right. Yeah, I'm that's sure right. It. It's going to be hard. We'll thrash our way around them to yeah. keep our fingers crossed. So everything's going great for you t towards London now, isn't it? Um, I mean, uh, uh, Reasonably. I'm certainly making a lot of progress when we consider how uh, desperately I was performing six weeks ago. Yeah. And my last three races now um, have been much more satisfactory. I'm going in the right direction. There's still a bit to find, to be honest. Um, I'm not going to run sort of 2 9 two ten on my present forum, but there's five weeks to go. Yeah. And uh, if things keep going the right way, then... I'm optimistic that I'm in for a good run. It's been a great uh, fill up to the local area to have a runner such as yourself and I think it's, it's coming right through the club. Uh, do you see this, your own influence? Well I was a little disappointed that in the first uh, few months I was down here things didn't go very well. Um, I think it was due to you know, arriving in the area, setting up house, getting into the new job mm. and I just wasn't able to concentrate on my running. So that I was a bit uh, unhappy that I wasn't creating the uh, um, required enthusiasm. But Great. Okay, Jim, I, ho I hope you do great in London. Well done. Thank you.